Internormans Contamination Control System CCS4 is a state-of-the-art mobile measuring system. The integrated sensor system enables an exact determination of the particle size distribution of the contamination, the water saturation and fluid temperature. The CCS4 can be connected to hydraulic systems with an operating pressure up to 420 bar directly by using a high pressure connection. It can also extract the fluid which is supposed to be measured directly out of a tank using an integrated pump. Thanks to an integrated and quickly replaceable battery, the CCS4 can be used anytime in locations without power supply voltage. After selecting the online mode, the user can choose between the following measurement types. Single, continuous and cyclic and the following particle counting standards. ISO, NAS and SAEAS and choose one of two possible operating modes. Pressure or suction operating mode. Thanks to a fluid database stored within the CCS4, the indication of the water content in PPM is possible based on the percentage of water content combined with the temperature and corresponding saturation curve. Before each series of measurements, the CCS4 passing through a series of flushing cycles during which the piston system is repeatedly filled and emptied in order to remove residues of previous measurements from the hydraulic system. During a single measurement, three measurement cycles are being completed according to a previously set operating mode and a preset output standard. From the measurement results of these three single cycles, an average value is being formed which represents the actual measurement result. The last measurement shown already includes the calculated average of the previous measurements. During a continuous measurement, same as during a single measurement, the user is able to choose between the following particle counting standards. ISO, NAS and SAEAS and choose one of two possible operating modes, pressure or suction operating mode. Same as in case of a single measurement, before a continuous measurement several flushing cycles have to be completed in order to avoid inaccurate measurement results caused by fluid residue from previous measurements. In the continuous measurement mode, the CCS4 measures permanently. After each measurement, the value for the corresponding cleanliness class is entered into a diagram shown on the display. The resulting curve of up to 80 measurements shows trends. The CCS4 is therefore suitable for initial operations and cleaning cycles. During a cyclic measurement, same as during a single or continuous measurement, the user is able to choose between the following particle counting standards. ISO, NAS and SAEAS and choose one of two possible operating modes, pressure or suction operating mode. Additionally, parameters such as the cycle period, number of cycles, storage automation and automatic print can be queried. To obtain reliable and credible results, the CCS4 has to be flushed as well before starting the cyclic measurement time. As there can be longer time intervals between each single measurement, when this measurement type has been chosen, the CCS4 has to be flushed before each measurement. During a cyclic measurement, same as when the single measurement type has been chosen, three measurements have to be completed in order to form an average value. The user can flexibly set the time between two measurements, from half an hour to 24 hours, which makes the CCS4 particularly suitable for long-lasting filtration processes.
Thanks to an integrated transfer function of the CCS4, it is possible to copy temporarily saved or stored data to a PC or save as a text file on a USB flash drive. Measurements temporarily saved or stored in the file system are visible and printable at any time. A graphic presentation of continuous measurements can be displayed at any time as well. Pressing the Escape key in the main menu will indicate the current charge status of the battery. In connection with the BSS2, the CCS4 can also be used on the lab terms to analyze fluid samples. The fluid samples are degassed with the BSS2 and supplied to the CCS4 afterwards in the offline mode. By shaking the fluids, an even particle distribution can be achieved in the sample, however, the shaking of samples is not without problems as air also gets dispersed. A sample with fine in the fluid dissolved air can be degassed on the vacuum by means of the BSS2. After that it is ready for particle measurement according to the valid standards. The display in the offline mode strongly differs from the display in the different online modes. Both the flushing time of the piston system and the start of the measurement can be adjusted manually. So the manual adjusting of the flushing time allows also measuring samples with small volume only. By starting the measurement, the piston system fills up and the measurement is being carried out. After one measurement cycle, a new measurement can be started, which has to be reconfirmed by keystroke. Due to the thermal printer being integrated in the unit, a printout per measuring point can be issued at any time. All information in the printout can be defined in the setup. That means the printout shows only information relevant for the respective user.